I've been watching some of my own my old content from 2022 uh, with the Earth Goddess characters and it reminded me of a mission that I'm here to do. Uh, it's part of the Plan B uh, motivation, which is justice for Earth. And basically, because the humans aren't really listening to my warnings about these Galactic Federation aliens and such, then that leaves me no other option but to journey into the underworld, which I have visited, and recruit an army of demonic beings and freaky spirits uh, to fight in this war, this spiritual war against the interdimensional entities that are bucking with us. Reptilians, possibly. Um, Galactic Federation, the Grey Aliens. Any of these aliens claiming to be from space, basically. Um, so if you want to join me in my uh, army, there's a few like criterias that um, it's preferred that you have these skills. So I'll add them into this video. Also, you need to have made friends with your demons or maybe you know how to slay demons. You've been in combat with them and won or you've like merged with them like me and they've become like your allies. That's another uh, skill set that is required for this. Uh, if you have had connection with goddesses, deities, female ones. Um, it'd be great if you had like bipolar or schizophrenia or ADHD and you realised your true power. Um, I need those people on my, t on my army. Um, they have a lot of information that they receive. That's important. And um, basically not scared to face your darkness and dig deep within your subconscious to see what is, un is hidden there. We all have a subconscious part of ourselves. It drives our motivations in ways that we can't detect. It's subconscious, it's sub-level. We're going to that place symbolically and literally to a place deep within the earth or deep within the subconscious where all the demons dwell. So basically, as you've been watching my videos, you know that I believe that the afterlife is under attack, that the astral realm has been breached. And all the afterlife realms are in jeopardy, but the underworld is different. It's a different kind of afterlife. Think of the underworld as the wall in Game of Thrones, the TV series. They send criminals and convicts to the wall as like a jail sentence. And while they're there, they become hardened, brave fighters, soldiers, and they ward off evil presences from coming down past the wall into Bastros. The underworld on Earth is a similar kind of thing. They're the last line of defence. Earth's defences and protocols and um, procedures to do with interacting with interdimensional beings is so corrupted. It cannot be relied upon anymore. If they're not doing a good job, the gov government corrupt officials are making shady deals with these aliens at our expense. So the underworld now needs to step in and intervene and raise hell. There's a lot of angry souls and beings and demons in the underworld ready and waiting to retaliate. Okay, they've had to dwell there because we've turned our backs on them. They're spirit beings. Religion gave them the term demons and jinn. They're just spirits of the earth. They belong to the earth. And they want to take the earth back off these colonizing galactic entities and they need some humans to help re uh, trigger it, generate it. 
and I've been working with making some alliances with some of them since 2020. It's been rough. It wasn't easy. I got hurt a lot and scared and frightened. But I overcame that and I stepped up to the plate. I'm a brave person. I have courage. I have heart. I have a strategic mind uh, in this war. I believe that I'm here for this war. I came here for this. I got visited by goddesses and other spirit helpers. I have the blessings of the ancestors of the land of where I live. Um, made an allies with them. And I'm just trying, finding it hard to find human allies, actually, that actually care about this and want to join. Um, I would appreciate more involvement from people because we all have bits to add to the story. I don't know the whole story. I think I do sometimes. But, you know, I'm just here to sense the danger for Earth and humans of Earth. I've been sniffing around this danger for a few years now. I'm aware of who it is. I think I know why they're doing it. They're lying about where they're from. They're using AI androids posing as positive aliens from other galactic star systems, deceiving us. They are infiltrating the communication frequency lines. They have colonized the mind. They have put us in a society in a system that is not safe or healthy for children men women elderly all of it this is not a safe place for children the exploitation levels and child trafficking levels are gone to the level where we need to flush out all these entities guys this pedophile species other dimensional species the experiments are going to stop. The abductions are going to stop. The trashing of the earth is going to stop. Humans turning into robots. We won't let that happen. And we'll sort out the afterlife realms later. You know, apart from this mission, I also have a lot of other duties that involve me being involved with the spirit realm and all of the lost souls, there's groups of lost souls floating around, not knowing where to go. Their ancestors not there to guide them. One of the groups I'm connected to is the uh, soldier boys from World War One and World War Two. They're lost in purgatory. They want to go home. I have to help these souls get transferred where they need to be. I have to ferry them to their where they need to be. But where they need to be. The place that I'm wanting to help them get to is under attack from our enemies and their allies. So they're just floating around in the ether, not knowing what the fuck's going on or how they got there, where, where they're going. They can't even reincarnate for some reason. So... Uh, Oh, also, if you want to be part of this army, we're not really into the whole love and light, high vibe, hypnosis, ecstasy rush buzz that you guys, a lot of people seem to be on these days. We're dark. We were birthed from the dark, from the subconscious, from deep within the earth. And it's going to help us win this war, I believe. And we can merge with the light, light and dark forces together for the common enemy.